Right, I'm starting it back here because when I was in the shop, uh, I noticed a photocopy and I clicked on it, it said free copies. Yes, so, I need some help, Mr. Postmaster Boyle. What can I do? And also, as well, um, do you remember in the hotel there was something about the bloke who checked in? Yeah, I'll double click that and it picked up, so I don't know if that would be of any reports at some point. I'm sorry, young. Come on. Well, I do have. Afraid not, son. I'm. It's very. That's. Next time you. Alright. Well, let's try loading again and see if when I say, can't you just copy one? Let's see if it can. Yeah. I need some post. Come on. Well, I. It's not the. I'm so. It's very important. That's what they. Next time you post. Is it on here at all? I was hoping it'd give me the option. Breaks up, breaks up, breaks up. Three o'clock, three times. Where's the exit? Oh. Let's go talk to my mate. <laughs> oh! Uh... That... So you... Who are... Cur Those... Why you ask? I'm just. <laughs> anyway, it shows he keeps the button on him, yeah? I keep it up. So at least we know where the button is. No cup. Son, when you've had your body shot in half, you know a thing or two about fear. You learn that when something actually happens, it's never as bad as you imagine it would be. Oh, sure, I can't write my name in the snow. I had to shell out a few simoleons for portable IV drips, colostomy bags, and so on. The pain is hardly what I'd call constant. I have my good days when I pass out completely. We're never asked to endure more than we're capable of handling, mister. Folks would die in a nuclear holocaust, but nobody would die who wasn't going to die anyway sooner or later. And the rest of us? I would take a little R&R &R at the old radiation bunker, climb out in two weeks, and go back to work, refreshed and ready to contribute as productive members of society again. Makes me wonder why I don't just push the button and take me a nice vacation. Can you give me any reason why I shouldn't? You're right, soldier. Sorry. Sometimes the intense oh God, pain clouds my mind. The kookaburros start whispering to me about the pretty mangoes and the high trees. And I know they can see me. They see all of us. Can't you hear them? Chattering with the llamas behind our backs? They want our cornflakes, but they won't take the milk! Have you lost your mind? You think you can toy with me just because I have no Lord Tarso, you damn kid, you? Or maybe you're one of those commie bastards. Oh, shit. You say before you came to harvest, your lower torso was shot off in the war? That's right. I was behind enemy lines. The night was dark. The rain wet. Plastique I was supposed to rig the bridge with, precariously sandwiched between my knees as I crawled in the muddy mud. Ooh, nice. I didn't see the Jerry taking aim at me with his machine gun until half of me was flying through the air. With a quick spray of bullets in a straight line, it shot my body clean in two. 
My lower body landed at that Jerry's feet. I can still hear him laughing as I started crawling in the general direction of England, calling behind me in broken English. My friend, where is your legs? Looky, what have we here? Some legs? Hey, did they never lose some legs? I'll never forget looking back over my shoulder and seeing that crowd doing the can-can with my legs. <laughs> A few weeks later, with only my compass and a pair of nylons, I made it back to safety. Now the Krauts are our friends, and the commie bastards are our enemies. But even so, there's at least one crowd out there that I'll never invite over to Sunday dinner. Frankly, all these questions are making... Can you give... Appreciate your Oh, he's still gonna do it. Oh, I should have said that I had the rights and then run away from idiot. Yeah. Oh, so let's oh. fucking this twat. Yeah. That's what they are. Next time. Alright. So we'll skip to pretty much everything. Well, we'll see what other shit there is to say to you. Oh. So. Got. Those. Uh. Why are you at? I keep it up. I've fucked it up. Dialogue not on. Oh, there we go. Well, if you say Frank Lipster, then you. Right! You talk a good game, mister. But so does your average commie bastard. The Kremlin teaches its agents to talk their way out of a scrape. What do you think about that, son? The communists can hardly be said to have had a moment. You should have watched more TV and read less Dostoevsky if you wanted to pass for an American, comrade. So I need to press the bottom one. Fucking hell. He's an awkward prick, isn't he? I think I'm gonna actually save it when I'm actually there with him as well, because now I'm having to do this. Honey. Talk to this twit. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, Fuck off. Bye, oh, fuck off, you grumpy old prick. Next time you... Uh, what other words we got with clop, clop, glop? Should we go for, oh we'll go with glop. 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 Oh, who goes there? Uh, they tell me my name. Those pen. Let's ask about the Aside items. from your commie bastard, your alien from another planet is the greatest threat to our democratic way of life. Did you know that 90% of sightings occur within the area of military installations? Hell, I shoot at them whenever I see their ships fly over, and my bullets ping harmlessly off of their hulls. I suspect those things operate out of a barge, but just try to convince anyone in harvest of that. I tell you, son, a 
nuclear holocaust would be preferable to a takeover by big-headed aliens from Pluto. Lucky for us, I'll be making that call when the time comes. Son, when you've had your... Oh, shoot. Oh, I've pressed the wrong thing before. We all have orders to You're right, on. so... Have you lost your mind? You think you can toy with me just because I have no Lord Tarso, you damn kid, you? You say... Harvest is a fine <laughs> town, steeped in traditional American values. But that lodge, well, it makes me suspicious, don't mind saying it. They've got their fingers into everything around here. Like a certain red commie bastard menace which shall be nameless. You read me wrong, mister. I think you should join the lodge, infiltrate it and report back on any red sympathizers. Your report could affect my decision on what I've got to do. Remember. Want to find out a side different file. Lock. Bolt! It's just me! What do you want? I don't know. That's good. Someone has to keep... I'm glad you stopped by again. Hang on. Let, let me escape. Remember! Oh, shoot. Onto that side. Bolt! Who goes there? It's just me, Steve! What do you want? Did the llamas send you? Okay. I knew it! They won't leave me alone! So he's gonna shoot me, right. So, I wanna see what happens if we get out of that dilemma. Di dialogue, sorry. And you say, call me bastards, we go glop. Oh! Uh... Those oh, panty weights, that's why... Of course, they wouldn't have given you the, uh, button. If you were really, oh, say, emotionally unstable? Of course not. I was given a full exam by my captors in the concentration camp when I was captured during my second penetration behind enemy lines. A year after I lost my Lord Tarso. It was quite thorough. What did it say? I don't know. I can't read German. Okay, yeah, you can't get shot in two equal but separate portions without feeling a little down. Who wouldn't? That doesn't mean I'm unbalanced. A little lighter, maybe, but my balance is fine. Still, is it abnormal to harbor doubts late at night when your boots in the corner mock you? Is it sick to want to poke them in their eyelets and rip out their laughing tongues? Then you feel bad. And you invite them under the covers with you, but will they come? Oh no! Spit and polish, spit and polish, tromp, 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 a long, long way to temporary, especially when you're waddling on your hands. Get some gloves, they say, in their high-pitched little voices, and snicker in the bootlocker, talking to my jockstrap behind my back. They all deserve a good nuclear holocaust! Son, when you... No. Well, I say now we've all got orders to follow. You're right, soldier. Right, we said about cornflakes. Have you lost... 
Now it's all safe. Takes us to a earth craft. My side can you right. right. Sure with this guy close to us. Take that. Alright, we'll save that on the floor. And I'll see you on the flip flop.